hello everyone and welcome back to my channel again dear friends hope you are all doing well so we are discussing about the model question paper of the mathematics subject for triple e stream students okay so far we have discussed the varieties of problems if you have not watched it yet i have provided the link in the description box you can watch okay today i am with the the model third over here this is your question number fifth b find the fourier sine series for f of x is equal to cos of x in zero to pi interval so you should remember here the formula for the Fourier sine series. So it is given by f of x is equal to summation of n running from 1 to infinity b n sine of nx, where this bn is the Fourier coefficient. It is equal to 2 upon pi integration of 0 to pi f of x sine of nx dx. Okay. So now let us solve it. This is your 2 by pi integration of 0 to pi. What is the f of x value? It is given in the question. That is cos of x sine of nx dx. Right. Now I can write it as 2 by pi 0 to pi this sin x sin nx I will bring first then cos of x dx. Now it becomes the formula over here. See if I just write 1 upon pi 0 to pi this 2 I will get inside I will take it inside that is 2 sin of nx cos of x dx right. This is now formula <coughs> that is 2 sin of a cos of b is equal to sine of a plus b right plus sine of a minus b over here okay i hope you are getting now what is the coefficient of x n so a is equal to n over here and coefficient of x is 1 over here that is b is equal to 1 okay i hope you are following so bn is equal to 1 upon pi integration of 0 to pi I can write here now formula sine of a a is n over here okay sine of n plus b is 1 times x then cos of sorry plus sine of a value is n minus b that is 1 into x okay dx this is your formula right now accordingly I will proceed so b n is equal to 1 upon pi so what is the integration of sine n plus 1 x that is cos of sorry minus times cos of n plus 1 x divided by n plus 1 minus integration of sin n minus 1 x is again minus of cos of n minus 1 into x divided by n minus 1 where your limits are 0 to pi over here right so here we have b n is equal to 1 upon pi right if i just apply now limits upper limit minus lower limit so i will get minus cos of n plus 1 into pi divided by n plus 1 minus cos of n minus 1 into x divided by n minus 1 this is your upper limit now minus lower limit uh, just minus cos of n plus 1 into 0 divided by n plus 1 okay minus cos of n minus 1 into 0 divided by n plus 1 this is your upper limit minus lower limit now i will get b n is equal to 1 upon pi minus cos of n plus 1 into pi divided by n plus 1 minus cos of n minus 1 into pi divided by n minus 1 okay minus into minus is plus this is your cos of 0 cos of 0 is always equal to 1 divided by n plus 1 this minus into minus is plus cos of 0 is again 1 divided by n plus 1 so this becomes the equation here now <clears throat> let me oversimplify it so b n is equal to 1 by pi 1 by pi into minus of cos of n plus 1 into pi let me tell you over here so cos of n plus 1 into pi it is always equal to minus 1 raised to the power n plus 1 okay so i can write here minus into cos of n plus 1 pi instead i can write minus 1 raised to the power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 right minus again cos of n minus 1 into pi it is equal to minus 1 raised to the power n minus 1 divided by n minus 1 plus 1 upon n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 okay so now b n is equal to 1 upon pi okay which is equal to now i can write here see this is minus i can write here minus 1 raised power 1 it is same thing okay into minus 1 i will just uh, make it separate over here so minus 1 raised power n into minus 1 raised power 1 bases are same powers are added n plus 1 you will get again the same term okay divided by n plus 1 minus 
here I can write down the same suppose plus minus 1 raised to power 1 okay this is your minus here so minus 1 raised to power 1 into minus 1 raised to power n minus into minus 1 raised to power 1 so bases are same powers are added means you are getting sorry here is minus 1 okay so same thing you will get uh, the purpose of making this you will see in the next sub next step over there n minus 1 plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 okay now bn is equal to 1 by pi minus 1 into minus 1 that is plus 1 so only i will left with one term that is minus 1 is for n uh, n plus 1 okay plus this minus 1 is power 1 minus 1 is for minus 1 this will get cancelled i will get with minus 1 is power n n minus 1 right then plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 okay i hope you are following so bn is equal to so bn is equal to 1 upon pi this minus 1 raised power n i will take common i will get with 1 divided by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 and plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 okay now i can take bn is equal to 1 upon pi i will take this 1 by n plus 1 1 divided by n minus 1 1 divided by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 common 1 divided by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 i am taking common i will get with minus 1 raised power n okay plus 1 over here right now <clears throat> if n is odd see here carefully observe carefully suppose if it is n is odd odd means 1 3 5 if i uh, just take one value so i will get minus 1 plus 1 so that becomes 0 so if n is odd that uh, b n will be equal 0 if n is even okay if n is even you will get bn value as suppose even is 2 minus 1 square is 1 1 plus 1 is 2 so i can write here bn is equal to 1 upon pi 1 by n plus 1 plus 1 divided by n minus 1 into 1 plus 1 okay just because i am taking even number here right now bn is equal to 2 by pi right <clears throat> this is your 1 plus 1 2 i will take out 2 by pi then n minus 1 into 1 n minus 1 plus n plus 1 into 1 is n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 into n minus 1 okay so bn is equal to 2 by pi this is your minus 1 plus 1 get cancelled 2n divided by a plus b into a minus b is a square minus b square right this is your bn is equal to 4 times n divided by pi into n square minus 1 so this is your whole bn term so i can write down here bn is equal to 0 if n is odd okay so 4 bn is equal to 4 by 4 n pi into n square minus 1 if n is even right i hope you are following now bn value we are getting here now you have to put down this particular equation in the given series over here that is f of x is equal to bn sine of x let me write it over here now yeah this is your sorry f of x is equal to summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity bn sine of nx this is your fourier sine series for uh, f of x over here so now i can write summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity what is the bn value we are getting here bn value is 4 n divided by pi n square minus 1 okay so 4 n divided by pi into n square minus 1 this is the value sine nx okay so f of x i can take this 4 out over here so i can write f of x is equal to 4 and pi i will take out 4 by pi summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity this is your n divided by n square minus 1 sine of nx this is your required fourier series for this particular question i hope it is clear to you people so make sure you will share it with your all friends who actually need it and thanks for watching my video Thank you.